In today's video, I'll be showing you how to change your default browser in Windows 11. So the first thing that you need to do is right click on the start menu icon. You now need to select settings. And you then need to go ahead and click on apps in the left hand menu. And you now need to select default apps. The next thing you need to do is click in the search apps box and you now need to type in the browser which you would like to use as your default web browser. So I'm going to use Chrome. You now need to select the web browser and you're now going to see all the default file types or link types. So as you can see, currently they are all being used by Microsoft Edge. You now need to change these to your browser, which you would like to use. And to do this, all you need to do is simply click underneath each option and then click on switch anyway and you now need to select the browser you'd like to use. So I'm going to use Chrome and press OK. You now need to do this for each option. The next option is PDF. If you already have a PDF viewer, then you don't need to change this. So you can then move on to the next option and go ahead and change this as well. And if we keep going down, we can change all these options. Ideally, the only options you do need to change really are the HTTP, HTTPS, and also HTM and HTML. The other options you don't really need to worry about. So once you are happy with the changes you have made, the next thing you need to do is minimize the settings, go down to your taskbar and you will see Edge. You now need to right click on Edge and go unpin from taskbar. You now need to open up the start menu and you then need to search for your browser. You're now going to want to click on pin to start and also pin to taskbar. You now have your default browser down in the taskbar and when you open up the extensions that you chosen, so .html, .htm and stuff like that, it will use your new browser. So I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, click the like button below and if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then hit that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.